St Surf Church is in Dunning, Strathern. It's named after a picture saint of the 6th century who was closely linked with St Mungo or Kentigen. The legend goes that the princess became pregnant without being married and was thrown from a cliff. She miraculously survived the fall and a boat took her to Carus, where St Surf lived. He looked after her and he raised the boy as his own, the boy being St Mungo or Kentigen. St Surf is mainly commemorated in Fife, but also the church Dal Surf exists in the Clyde Valley. Local to Dunning is said to have killed a dragon with his staff. The Norman Tower dates from about 1150 AD. It's a remarkable survival. The church was extended in the 17th century by the local family, the local lairds, the Rolos of Duncrub. They built the back stairs which runs up to the laird's loft in 1687. It's thought that Dunning had a religious settlement since at least the 8th century, and there are carved stones dating from the 9th and 10th. The church is no longer in use, but it contains the Duplin cross, which came from near Fort Tidiot. This is a very rare Pictish high cross. It contains the carving of a king, a named king of the Pictish times. In the village square stands an ornate Gothic style drinking fountain. The church is one of the few buildings in the village to survive the Jacobite rebellion and a fire that took place in 1716. The entrance to the church is a guardhouse. In the days of the body snatchers or resurrectionists, guards were posted here to prevent bodies from being taken. <laughs> 